What's up, everybody? And my name is Krim, and welcome. Welcome, ARMY, to my reaction to BTS's Life Goes On, official MV, which came out almost two hours ago. Now, I'm excited to see this because I think it's the last MV that they'll be together. Um, as we know, Jin is really is really close to getting going to the military. His mandatory service comes up really soon, and he should be enlisting, I think, either by the beginning of next year or probably in December. Um, for me personally, I'm very proud of what BTS has become. I am not a stan. I'm not an army. I am a fan. I do appreciate them, and I really love their group. I think they've done a really good job. The love of my life is a really big army fan. She absolutely loves BTS, and, you know... There is a lot of reasons, and she always says the biggest reasons, there's a lot of meaning behind their music. And to see this probably being the last MV for probably three or three years, two or three years that they will all be together, it is going to be a very, it should be a very big event. I'm honestly surprised that it only has 16 million views. I was expecting it already to have, it in two hours, probably over 100 million views. This is probably one of the biggest things in the world, considering this could possibly be the last one. If I remember, and I'm just going to re reminisce because I think it's a good thing for us to do always. I remember finding this group randomly on their debut when I was, what was that? It was 2000, I was like 15, 16. Like, I was a good while ago. That was like seven, seven or eight years ago. I, I discovered this group. And, you know, I looked and I was like, wow, there's something. This is a fun group to watch. I really love watching them. And No Dream, I literally played No Dr uh, No More Dream probably on repeat for two weeks, three weeks, maybe four, maybe a month. I played their song a lot on repeat. I remember that. I remember RM's goofy, like really, I loved his hairstyle, his goofy ass glasses, Sugar looking like a boss, J-Hope being my bias right off the bat, you know, Jimin, Jungkook. All of them looking really, really cool. You know, Jin looking handsome as ever. And then V, V looking like the punk little boy he was at the time. You know, it was just so cool to reminisce and think about that when this is going to be their last probably MV as all, as all them. As an international K-pop um, person, I'm really glad that BTS was like, hey, it'll be an honor for us to actually still serve in the, in the military. It, and it's because honestly the the government could have been like hey you've done so much for us because they brought in so much more to korea that the government honestly should have been like hey you guys don't have to go but i think even if they did that bts would have been like hey we're gonna go to the military um they've changed the world and we all can agree with that um if I am wrong that this is not the last last one, but Life Goes On literally sounds like the last song for a good bit while they're all together. Um, thank you for so many wonderful memories and thank you. And I can't wait for you guys to come back in a couple years fully together. And I'm excited to see what you guys do from now on when, you got, when your members are going to the military. Because I think next year is another big year where I think Suga, RM, I think even J-Hope is going to go. Like, the rappers all pretty much go in one year. V, um, Jimin will probably go in another year, and then J Jungkook would be the last. So we probably got four years that we're going to have this group not have a couple of its members, but it's going to be interesting to see. Um, but we always will love them, and I think I will always enjoy their music, and I always will be here to watch it. And I'm, I usually don't re – I like to enjoy BTS kind of, like, on my own, but I think it's good that I actually made a video for them. Because they're, they've done so much more to K-pop. They've opened eyes all over the world in so many different ways. And yes, the kings of K-pop are still Big Bane. But the ambassadors, like the ambassadors of K-pop are BTS. I think that's a better way to put it. They are the ones who re really, really, truly represent um, what K-pop has be what K-pop is. And a lot of and a lot of people were like, they don't sound like they're not K-pop anymore. No, they are global stars now. Same like B uh, Blackpink, they are global stars, and we need to look at them in that way. They are another. They've hit another tier, and so let's enjoy this. I'm really excited to enjoy this MV. Um, let's go on with it. And that was just my take and how I feel about this being their last MV, probably.
So let's hit it. If you like this video, leave a like, subscribe, hit the bell button, and let's enjoy this together. Let's go. I should have watched this on Premiere, but I didn't think it was dropping today, and I should have paid too much attention. V, you look so handsome, man. I'm proud of you. I hope they do like flashbacks. Jungkook, he's still handsome. Handsome as always. Our record breaker. <laughs> Jim has got the one of the best voices ever. RM, I love your rap, man. <laughs> There's still kids at heart. Oh, Jen. I'm going to miss you, buddy. Yeah, Jin deserves, like, his spotlight. I'm glad they put Jin in the middle. Wow. I really wish they could have done like one more concert where they could have seen all their fans. They deserved it. I'm sorry. It's just emotional, I think, when you've watched a group pretty much grow up. I think from the very start and beginning. And I never, yeah, I never was an army. 
but there's still something like they're still a part of you and you can think of so much about them they've done so much and you recognize the beauty that they've brought to the world i think in a world that there's a lot of darkness there's groups like this and there's musicians like this who kind of distract us and bring us away from um that bad reality that harsh world that is out there and you know you kind of like you wish so much more f from them because you just want them to constantly bring you that joy and i think that this is a good example of like the beauty just like off of the mv the mv was simple it wasn't fan it wasn't like outrageously in insane like i'm looking through here you know it's just kind of like how they were in the dorms you know i saw this like v's driving them right but and he's looking back constantly like he's trying to look at the them for the last time and then he got jim and and jim and jungkook like at the dorm again they're having a good time rm being the leader he's looking out into the sky thinking of new ideas thinking about his group thinking about what he what the what their next step would be you know and then there's them all together they're having a good time they're having fun they're showing them to be the boys and just kind of like enjoying themselves and i think you know this is a big moment when they're all having fun in the back and i think when i was looking at this it's like jin jin's looking back and he's like missing he's gonna miss them he just wants to keep that in their head is that image of all of them that, that this kind of hit me hard You know, they're all watching movies for, like, the last time. They're just enjoying life together. You know, they shot a bunch of little films of what they were doing. Smiling, have a good time. Beautiful photos. All together. It's, just, it's like a song of memories, it feels like. You got Suga and J-Hope doing their part. Wrapping their part of the song, you know. It's just, it's beautiful. I think. While they're all sleeping and Jin's just talking, you know, it kind of shows like, hey. I want it's, it's like he wanted some alone time. With all of us, it felt like it, that's kind of what I got. So I felt like he just wanted some alone time with us to look at us, to kind of us look at him and just know that that how much he loves us in just a simple way. And him with him saying, like, hold my hand. Because we do, we, we, we hold their hands for guidance. You know, I think there's a lot of times that we don't really understand what we're doing. And we, we hold, we reach our hands out to somebody to really cherish and to kind of look up to and wish more from, you know. It's just something that, we need you know we need that person and this is what bts has been for many many people all over the world they've been a, a, a hand for them to hold to look up to and to ask for help you know in the heart of dark times and they did a beautiful thing for jin in this mv and this may be the most beautiful mv for different reasons for the meaning of it and for the beauty that they've done you can't capture anywhere else and thank you bts for all the years that you've given everybody and we're excited to, we're gonna still cheer you on and we accept we are ready for this next chapter of you know you guys being in the military and your fans will still be here and when you guys come back in full force it'll be probably one of the biggest things in the world it's going to be one of the biggest things in the world Thank you, BTS. Thank you, RM, Jin, Jungkook, V, you know, Jimin, Suga, all of you guys. Thank you. Thank you very much, and good luck. Good luck out there. We love you. With that said, guys, I'm sorry that this was kind of a more emotional video. But I wish you guys all the best. And I hope that you guys can look for somebody to hold a hand, to hold their hand and to find peace in, the very, in a world that's very complicated. 
I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Leave a like, subscribe, hit the bell button. And if you need me to hold your hand, I will as well. Bye.